Hey YouTube, JT here. And we're going to take a look at a Spyderco Zable Fly Butterfly Knife uh, Bali Flipper. I got this from uh, Zabel Inc. Let me see here. Okay, so it has a spring loaded latch here. And to open it, all you do is squeeze it and it pops open. You can flip this bad boy. Oh, I'm not much of a flipper. I like Sung Wei. But yeah, you flip it open. So the blade steel on this is VG10. I don't know if you can make it out. This is a Flip Mino HD, so it's not as a not a good not as good a camera as humans for target has. It doesn't have the autofocus and the close-up capabilities. Anyways, VG10, and I've seen the other Zabel flies had 154 cm, so I don't know the history on that. I don't know which came first or when they made the change. But I, I'll attach some reviews and some other videos. So Lacey Zabel's name there is etched in the knife, along with the spider cool uh, spider there. Nothing on the other side. But just look at these uh, aggressive lines on this scythe kind of blade. This blade design is uh, signature to Lacey Zabel. I say, okay, so VG10 blade length is four inches. Overall length is ten inches. See, it's a mean curves. Weight, 5.6 ounces. There's a pocket clip. And it's reversible. And you notice, you can't lock this thing open. Supposedly if the knife can be locked closed and not, not locked open, it's uh, legal in some states, but you would have to um, do some research to see if it's legal in your state. Butterfly knives are not legal here in a way. Let me open this. On the safe side of the the handle on the safe side of the blade, they call it a safe side because it's the back of the back of the knife. It has these three spacers. On the other hand though, you got this huge stainless steel spacer. So this handle here is a weight it's gonna be flying over. So I guess if you're not used to it, if you if you're one of those guys that like butterfly knives and, and flip a lot of um bollies, it may maybe something you have to get used to. Sungway 9 has a, has a video out on this um, Zabel Fly. And that guy is a young, uh, young maestro, master in flipping uh, bollies. And then he added, uh, he put the knife up for a pass around where other people can uh, have an opportunity to try it. And uh, Cutlery Lover was like third in line. So he, Cutlery Lover has a video too. So I'll, I'll attach a link to that. All right, um, it's uh, made in the USA. Though the way I got a hold of this knife was I ordered uh, several items from Zabel Inc. and one of the items I wasn't satisfied with. Long story short, Lacey uh, offered me a discount on a future purchase, and I decided this. So he gave me a discount on this. Um, it's one ninety eight on his uh, website. So he gave me a discount on the knife, and check this out. He threw in this Kydex, this sheet, this um, shoulder harness system from Survival Sheet Systems. And this thing is cool. I mean, it gives you an, altern an alternate way of carrying it.
Check that out. And I wore it for a little while. This thing is comfortable. I mean, compared to some other shoulder holsters that I've had. And I guess since the knife is lighter than a firearm. But this survival sheet systems, they make um, shoulder holsters for where one side can be the firearm, other side spare ammo or handcuffs. But they also make it like, as, as you see here, where you can uh, carry a knife in a shoulder holster. And you can carry two knives, one on both sides. I'll put a link to their site too. This uh, Zabo fly, I thought it was discontinued and out of production. But uh, I guess, well, I guess since Lacey was a partner, he, he might have some uh, reserve or back stock. So he's selling on his uh, Zabo Ink site for 198 with the harness is 250. The harness alone is 60 bucks. But uh, a fast search in Google, and I found Blade Up selling it for like 219. Knife Center selling it for 199.95, and then Blade HQ selling it for 229. So I guess if you want to get a hold of one, there's some there's some sites that still have one. All right. Um, well, for me, this is going to be part of my collection. I'm not much of a flipper. Not since my younger days when I used to play with butterfly knives. But uh, it's a great addition to anybody's collection. Alright guys, watch your six. JT out.